This is Meenakshi Dev Chaudhary, who is an embryologist at a IVF center in Mumbai. So, Meenakshi, why don't you give us a brief of your career and what your and where did you study and what is your main motivation to be an embryologist? Yeah, hi, hi, Johan. I'm Meenakshi Dev Chaudhary, working as an embryologist in Mumbai. I uh, started my career in Guwahati uh, after passing my master's in science. I joined a IVF center uh, in downtown hospital, one of the leading hospitals of Northeast, as a junior or a trainee embryologist. Uh, after that, I was sent for training to various parts of the country. And uh, after which I continued with my uh, work as a junior embryologist in downtown hospital. Uh, during that time, I got experience through various processes uh, of the IVF lab. So um, I enjoyed my work there and got a lot of experience. In 2005, I quit my job and started working as a freelance embryologist in Northeast India. During that time, I went to uh, many IVF centers in Northeast and helped them to st start up new IVF labs. Uh, after that, in 2006, I shifted to Mumbai. And uh, since then, I have been working as an embryologist, followed by now being the chief embryologist in an IVF center in Mumbai. All right. Uh, the the motivation, like you asked, was that uh, my father, being a scientist, uh, a laboratory work had great fascination for me. So when I got this opportunity, I took it immediately. Uh, and I'm very happy with what I'm doing right now. All right. So how do you feel that technology will impact, the, impact how, how you work in the next 10 years? Uh, Technology has always played a great role in IVF. Everything is about technology. Once we take the eggs out of the human body, after that, um, it grows inside a laboratory in very important equipments like the incubator, the, uh, the triple gas incubator, the Benstock incubator. So all these are related to technology. Besides that, new microscopes are being developed new technologies coming in to help uh, detect and treat patients. So technology has a great role in IVF in the next 10 years. Especially now, artificial intelligence is being applied for uh, our procedures. All right. So what guidance do you have for stu some students who are looking to pursue a career in IVF? Uh, the students now need to concentrate and focus on their studies presently. Uh, they must learn about biology, chemistry, um, zoology, and uh, biochemistry to understand about the uh, embryology part. So once they have completed their studies, they can follow higher courses in this profession. All right. So thank you, Minakshi. Thank you for your time. Thank you.